We've been going through the different five lies, the different lies in the five lies. The third lie is this is a great part-time career. Doesn't that sound popular, though? That's something people say. Oh, about my gosh. I would have 100% thought be a stay-at-home mom and be a real estate agent. Yep. Now, let me ask you a quick question. How many stay-at-home moms, and I, you know me, my, my wife, under the technical definition, here's a stay-at-home mom. We think that's the best thing for our family. I love, I think it's the hardest job in the world. It's the most fruitful job in the world with eternal implications. Trust me, I, there is not a single ounce of me that doesn't love what, single, what, what, what stay-at-home moms, stay-at-home dads, whatever, do. Okay? But how many people do you know that are powerhouse attorneys that are stay-at-home moms? 0.0. 0. How many, how many world-class doctors, physicians, surgeons that are stay-at-home moms? Just can't do it. What about uh, like powerhouse uh, financial people, accountants, auditors, it's financial not, advisors? It's not happening. No one would think right. people that do a job that that's impactful and technical and specific and labor intensive. You know, we're not talking about swinging a sledgehammer labor. We're talking about hours and focus and energy on the job. No one would think you would do that part time. But in the world of real estate, it's very, very common. Now, I know there are people listening to me right now that I just made very, very angry. Because your question is, how am I supposed to do it full-time if I don't start part-time? This is my situation. You don't understand me. You know, your wife gets to stay at home, blah, 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 blah. I love you. I believe in you. I care for you. But there is a better way for you to transition into real estate. And the reason for that, and I will not apologize for this, is that the consumer deserves full-time focus. Now, I'm not going to say that you can't successfully transact real estate part-time. What I'm going to say is you can't do it at a world-class level over and over and over repeatedly with consistent, predictable results without killing yourself or without making sacrifices that I don't want you to have to make. So what we do here on the Todd Tremonti Home Selling Team and what we coach and consult with agents and brokers and teams all over the United States and Canada to do is to build a better business model so that people don't have to do that, so that they can get ready to join the brokerage, join the team, make a fully committed full transition and have a financial model that they don't have to go six months without income or go figure it out on their own or only work their personal sphere, which we talked about last week. So all of that is wrapped up in the lie that this is a great part-time career. It can be done that way, but not at a world-class level. And we are only interested in residential real estate if it's being done at a world-class level. That doesn't mean perfect. People are not perfect. Businesses are not perfect. But it means caring about your client, offering world-class expertise, offering phenomenal results, because obviously people care about results most, if not close to most, and doing it in a way that people would really enjoy that. So think about a world-class attorney, a world-class accountant, a world-class doctor, these are the most educated, committed, full-time, hardworking people, but they also can lead really wonderful lives. And that is possible in a real estate career here at the Todd Tremonti Home Selling Team. If you're interested in something like that, I want you to go to toddtremontiteam.com, track down the careers page, click any button, find any phone number, call us, email us, let us know that you would like to join our team. We have a Richardson office and a Fort Worth office. We cover the whole Metroplex. Our agents specialize on the buy side or the sell side. And they're only going to be successful here if they're competitive, fun, hardworking, fairly organized, really wonderful people that love to serve and lead and protect others. So that's what happens here.